The draw order or rendering order of the objects varies depending on the body part they belong to. If you click on part setting, you can see a column titled default draw order here. The value in each cell determines the draw order of that particular object. The greater the value, the more front or more at the top that each object is drawn. To change the draw order of objects, you can do so in the edit palette. You can change the value with this slider here or press these buttons to change the value by the unit of 100, 10 or 1. If you want to change the draw order within the group of objects that have the same value, go to Object and Placement to do so. If you want to move around objects across different body parts to which the objects will belong to, you can do that in uh, Edit Palette here. If you want to manipulate polygons after objects are already mapped out and placed, double click on the object or press Edit Texture while selecting it and you can manipulate polygons manually. The tip is to map polygons densely along lines like face lines because these are the areas that you will want subtle touch to it when it comes to deforming uh, later on in the modeling. For the same reason you normally need less polygons for areas with flat coloring or areas you don't, you, uh, you don't intend to deform much.